Hi guys, Big Phil here and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I want us to talk about the newly announced Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5. I was fortunate enough to spend so many hours with this device including the Z Fold 5 and the Watch 6 and 6 Classic. I was fortunate enough to spend so many hours with all these devices so I'll be able to provide you guys with in-depth hands-on video with everything you need to know about these devices. So in today's video, we're going to talk about the Z Flip 5, which I'm just going to say, guys, this is the perfect Z Flip to buy. This is the perfect flip phone to buy. I will explain later in this video. Just stay tuned to the end of this video and you will understand why I said this is the perfect Z Flip or the perfect flip phone to buy. So without wasting much time, let's talk about everything you need to know. But please don't forget to sub subscribe if you're new to this channel. And also give a thumbs up to this video if you like it now let's start by talking about the build quality which I would say it is great listen I've been a fan of the Z flip since the Z flip one I had the Z flip the first Z flip which I used it for almost three years but unfortunately it is dead now it just I mean it's dead it just died I don't know what happened but I'm still a fan of Z flip especially this Z Flip 5, mainly because Samsung have done an incredible job with the build quality of this phone. I feel like the phone has, has gotten so much better to the point where I can highly recommend a Z Flip over a traditional smartphone. The material in which this smartphone is made of are great. It is mostly glass, Gorilla Glass Victus 2, aluminum frame, and plastic on the display, which is obvious because it's a flip phone. It has an IPX8 water resistant, which means you can submerge this device up to 1.5 meter for about 30 minutes in water. Unfortunately, it still doesn't have a dust resistant. For the color options, there are so many colors to choose from if you are about to buy this smartphone. There are eight colors to choose from. There is graphite, cream, lavender, gray, blue, green, and two new colors, yellow and mint. Eight colors to choose from, guys. That is a lot. And that's one thing I love about Z Flip because it comes with stylish and flashy colors because Z Flip is just a cool smartphone. I had the original Z Flip and man, trust me, it was the coolest phone I've ever had. People were like, wow, what phone is that? What, your phone can flip? Your phone can fold? It's just the coolest phone in the world. So if you want those cool factors, if you want to look cool, if you want to be stand out from the crowd, get a Z Flip. And the phone is lightweight too. It weighs just around 187 grams. For the display of this smartphone, there are two displays. The main display is 6.7 inches of dynamic AMOLED 2X screen with a 120 Hz refresh rate and HDR10+. The brightness can go up to 1200 nits. Yes, that's a lot of brightness, which means you can use this smartphone in direct sunlight, in broad daylight without having any issue in terms of brightness. The secondary display has a Super AMOLED 3.4 inches, guys. Yes, finally, Samsung has stepped up their game when it comes to the outer display. They went in all out. The display is big, it's usable. You could do so much with the outer display. Another thing I love about this smartphone are the cameras. There are two main cameras and one selfie camera. The two main cameras are 12 megapixel. One has f1.8 and the second one has f2.2. And these cameras are much better than that of last year. I mean, I took some photos with it. Oh, they're super bright. The night mode is incredible. Much better than on the Z Flip 4. I've used so many Z Flips. And this, I would say this one right here has the best camera. Super bright. For videos, you could shoot 4K videos at up to 30 or 60 frames per second. 1080p at... 60 or 240 frames per second. Unfortunately, there is no uh, 8K video. For the front-facing camera, there is a 10 megapixel at f2.2, which is why what I love about the Z Flip 5 and the same thing I've loved with all Z Flips is the fact that you could take portrait photo. I mean, you could take a, 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 a selfie photos with the two main cameras, take videos with the two main cameras using the outer display. 
The Z Flip 5 is a flagship smartphone thanks to the fact that it is running on the latest processor. It has the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Generation 2 with Adriano 740 and Android 13 with Samsung One UI 5.1.1 on top of it. And another thing I love about this smartphone is the fact that the storage option has been improved. Instead of having 128 gigabyte as the base storage, now Samsung have bumped it up to 256 gigabyte with eight gig of RAM. So that's the base storage, but you can step it up to 512 gigabyte with also 12 gig of RAM. And the base storage, which is 256, goes for 1,000 US dollars. Way cheaper than the previous generation because last year Z Flip 4 was 128 gigabyte and it cost a thousand dollars, but this is 256, still cost the same a thousand dollars. The battery is one thing that hasn't improved with the Z Flip 5. It still has the 3,700 milliamps with a wire charging of up to 25 watt. Wireless charging 15 watt and reverse wireless charging of 4.5 watt. Other features that you get from this smartphone include Bluetooth 5.3, Wi Fi 6, NFC, GPS, USB Type C, and a side mounted fingerprint. Now, what is my final verdict about the Galaxy Z Flip 5? As I mentioned earlier from the start of this video, this is a perfect Z Flip, a perfect flip phone to buy. It has everything that we've been wishing for. For so many years, we've been asking Samsung to give us a bigger outer display. Samsung finally delivered, and the outer display is good looking, is bright, and very useful. Listen, I'm thinking of getting this Z Flip. I had the first original, original Z Flip. It died after three years. I was a little bit discouraged, but this has changed my mind. The Z Flip 5 has changed my mind about flip phone. I'm thinking of getting the green color. And thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any question, drop it down in the comment section. I'll reply to all questions. If there's anything you need to know, or you want to know about this smartphone or the other devices like the Fold 5, and the Watch 6 and 6 Classic, which the videos will be coming up very soon, just drop it down in the comment section. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button and turn on notification for a lot of good videos come up on Big Field TV. Until then, see you into the next one. Peace.